Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be unboxing the 2016 October Glossy Box. And look how gorgeous this box is. Like, just look at this. I think this is so pretty. So, um, this is actually the last Glossy Box that I will probably have on my channel because... I did a three month subscription and now my subscription's over and um, I don't think Glossy Box is a bad box at all but for its price point, like for Glossy Box's price, I get Ipsy and Birch Box. So you know, I'm just going to keep those two for right now and then use what I was spending on the Glossy Box to explore and discover other boxes. So let's get this open. Alright, oh it's so pretty inside. Okay, so we have a little card that <clears throat> says Secret Garden. So I'm going to assume that the theme of this is Secret Garden, which is beautiful. Let me show you the inside of this box since I just took it off. Look at that. This is a, I'm really sad that, I, that I'm not keeping this box. This is a beautiful box. All right, so when you pull the bow and you get the sticker off, Open it up. And that's what it's looking like inside. So, let's dig in. The first thing that I'm seeing in here is Capri Vince Camuto. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, it's a perfume. Okay. Oh, it's pretty. Okay. So, it looks like this. And, oh, it kind of smells like vodka. I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. It, to me, it just smells like alcohol. Okay, moving on. The next thing in here is a Civit Facial. Okay, so it says it's for all skin types. And I guess this opens up. And it just says that it's a liposomal vitamin C antioxidant moisturizing, clarifies spots, and reduces wrinkles. So I guess just a little treatment for your face. I'm excited to try that out. I don't have wrinkles yet, but, you know, prevention on early can be beneficial, right? So the next thing in here is a twist lipstick this is a raspberry twist lipstick so oh look at that kind of matches my nails so I'm just gonna swatch it on the back of my hand oh it's pretty I like that I might have to take this off and put this on I like that and that was in the shade let me see if you can hear if it'll focus no no it's in the shade Allure, since my camera never focuses. Alright, there are a couple more things in here. It appears to be an, oh, it's an eyebrow pencil. <laughs> an eyebrow pencil from Model Launcher. And it's in the shade Taupe. Um, I don't use taupe on my eyebrows. I kind of use, like, a darker brown. But, I mean, I can try it. I use taupe. A while ago when I was trying to figure out what I wanted for my eyebrows my eyebrows are kind of hard to match for me in my opinion because I am very pale and I'm naturally a blonde as you can tell from this mess going on up there um, but my eyebrows come in dark so when I was trying to fit my eyebrows I was like do I fit my blonde to make it look okay or do I go with the darker hair color and just do darker eyes. So let me pop this open. It's kind of angled, I guess, for the best eyebrow shape. And I'm gonna, oh, it's a little rough. I guess probably because you're not applying it rough, like in one go. So it looks like that, so that's not bad. I can work with that. I had a taupe pencil before, but it was like blonde as a taupe. So we also got this 
scents. It's a cleanser. It's a lightning cleanser that says it has a lipid bubbles solution. So a cleanser, it says it's for skins with spots or for dull skin. I have blemishes all over here. So, you know, I'm excited to try that out. So the last thing that's in here is a 24 karat Sally Hirschberger Supreme Stylish Dry Shampoo. Let me see. It's kind of it's kind of bright. I'm trying to fix my, my lighting. I'm just using sunlight and stuff like that. And then it's really hard for me to showcase the products. Go figure. So, ah, uh, uh, okay, so it's a 24 karat. The lid just came off. One second. Okay, so I got the lid back on and I'm trying to smell it, but it kind of smells like alcohol. I don't know if I just have alcohol in my brain. Like maybe it's time to turn up, but we're going to try it out. Smells like hairspray and alcohol. So, what is it supposed to do? Shake well before each use. I think I did that, but I'm not sure. Spray into hair, work with fingertips to build volume. Finish by lightly spraying over hair. So you spray it on your hair and then you work it in. Oh, it feels kind of like hairspray. Ugh. It says to achieve a desired volume, so. Okay. All right. And then it says to spray over your hair again to keep it that way. Okay. I mean, I'm not mad at it. The smell is okay. As I smelled it, as I sprayed it more, it doesn't smell like alcohol anymore. I think that's just in my brain. I think my brain wants alcohol. And, you know, it's not doing too bad on my hair. My hair just feel like kind of gross now. But other than that, like, it just feels dry, I guess you could say. My hair, I just washed it last night, but what else? Okay. So that was everything I received in my last glossy box. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.